We make a marvelous team, you and me, Mr. Jesse, with my brains and your... That didn't come out right. Red's here. So glad to see you back. All cried out from Daddy's funeral. Made peace with the fact that you never told him how much you loved him. Oh, wait. You didn't do any of that because William isn't dead. Instead, you and your band of grade-A chuckle fucks let the leader of America's goddamn vampire hunting agency turn into a goddamn vampire! Mr. Secretary, sir, if it weren't for Director Rentier, we never would have found Felicity and... Isn't that just fuckity great? Then I can assume you've got her severed head hidden behind your wiry dead ferret of a frame! Secretary Harrow! Dr. Blackwell, I can't believe I'm saying this. But as of right now, you are the fucking director of the soon-to-be-renamed Rentier Institute, with all the perks and privileges entitled therein. But for now, I want you to lock these sons of bitches up for high treason. And after that, you're gonna squeeze every bit of vital information out of the tick that's currently inhabiting the carcass of William Rentier. And once you're done, apply your own damn protocols and put a bullet in its head like you should have done days ago! Are you having some sort of female moment? I fucking want this fucking done right fucking now! Would you allow me to present a counterproposal? You leave Calico right now and never come back, you lying, sweaty, lecherous, potty-mouthed, flatulent, ugly mustache creep! You ungrateful swine! You sure you want to dance that dance? President Cleveland will know all about this right here. We're having dinner after a sweet-ass musical premiere none of you were invited to because you don't matter! Jesus, I thought I'd shit myself. Amelia, that was... potty mouth? I'm about 90% adrenaline right now, Jesse, so maybe you save your critiques for when my legs stop shaking. Right now, you should go see your father. thing that survived from the manor's fall. You should have seen that ugly kiss when I fired his ass with this. Oh, just wait till we all get those gauntlets Virgil's working on. We're gonna win this war. It's all my fault. Poor Martin. Don't blame yourself, kid. He was a friend. I promised to get him his gauntlet, but I was so busy, I just couldn't get to it. I should have resisted when Mr. Harrow sent him to Dickinson. It should have been me who went, not him. <laughs> Nerd.
gotta keep your guard up, Bloom. Don't drop your dukes. Yeah, but keep your elbows in. Gotta protect that breadbasket. <laughs> I... I... As you can see, the region compound appears to have some unexpected positive side effects. You know, I'm not the most attentive son, but I could have sworn your leg. I feel 20 years younger, Jesse. Get the Panzer wagon ready. You and I are gonna find Felicity, just like the old days. Let's just wait and see how this thing with Harrow's gonna land. Harold, pa! That two-bit tyrant could command his way out of an Oklahoma outhouse. Yeah. We sure he's all right? Well, from a purely virological standpoint, he should have turned days ago. If we're seeing nothing by now, I guess compound works. I can hear you, you know. Oh, better than ever. Goodness, you sound like Gravener with all your silly worrying. Where the hell is Edgar? 